Hi guys, it's your girl Tampkin Spice where we talk about tools and tech for body and beauty. And today I'm going to be talking about plenity and maybe you've already seen my first video where I do talk about plenity in my first five months on it and my results. So if you haven't checked out that video, do give that one a shot. But in this video, I'm going to be talking about why I am no longer going to be using plenity going forward. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so I don't want to get too much into the details and origin story of Plenity. Um, check out my first video for that. But just so you have a high level overview of what Plenity is, Plenity is a capsule created by the company Jealousis. And Jealousis has created this technology. So it's not really a diet pill, it's a diet tool because all Plenity is made of is cellulose and citric acid. So cellulose is just made of plants and plant fiber, like celery. Celery has a ton of cellulose in it. It is just a whole bunch of plant fiber mixed with citric acid to help bind it. And once you take the Plenity pills, what happens is it goes inside your stomach and it just grows in size. I don't know if you've ever eaten anything that kind of like is starchy or like has a lot of fiber in it, but after you eat it, you feel like you're just like, oh my gosh, so full. That's basically what Plenity does for you. It's equivalent to you having a whole bunch of vegetables before each meal so that all that fiber kind of goes in your stomach and sits in there. And that way, when you're starting to eat, you end up feeling a lot fuller faster. And of course, the cellulose, just like plant cellulose, just breaks down in your digestive system and you poop it out. So that's how Plenity works. The normal way of taking it is you take three pills 20 to 30 minutes before each meal. It's recommended that you take it with room temperature water, not cold water, because the Plenity capsules do get really, really huge and coagulate with warmer temperature. Of course, once the water's in your stomach, your body temperature is going to heat it up anyways, but it just happens to work faster if you drink it with room temperature water than with ice cold water. But it's really up to you what you want to do and how you want to ingest Plenity is up to you. Normally you do it for lunch and dinner. You'll take your Plenity, drink your water, wait 30 minutes, have lunch and do the same thing again for dinner. But personally, I started noticing recently is I was just getting less and less hungry over time. So the first five months I had really great results. I mean, I was never trying to take Plenity to lose a whole bunch of weight anyways. Remember Plenity is FDA approved for anyone with BMI 25 and above. I know I look really hot and sexy, but my BMI was 25 at the time of, you know, me purchasing Plenity and getting the prescription for it. So don't worry, I was just a couple pounds off. And I honestly, after, after a long time, I've been thinking about it. I think BMI is kind of a BS like kind of calculation because as someone who's a lot more muscular, my weight is going to be a lot higher for my height than it would be for someone else that maybe potentially looks the same. Like I'm a thick girl. Like I have muscle, I work out, I lift weights, I have a healthy active lifestyle. And if I feel good and if I feel healthy, then, then I'm fine. So my goal in the beginning to get plenity was two things. One, I wanted to lose just a couple of pounds to get ready for the summer. Well, this was before COVID and everything. So I thought I was gonna have this amazing summer and go to Europe and all this stuff. So that was my goal at the time. Two, I don't know if you guys know, but my weight has gone up and down for the same 40 to 50 pounds that I have gained and lost five times in my life. So I have a really hard time with maintaining a healthy weight. I know I look great right now, but let me tell you, there's a story behind it. My whole life, I've had a really bad relationship with food and a really bad body image, and it's taken me a lot to really overcome it. And it's really taken a lot of work for me to be able to get in touch with my body to the point where I can intuitively eat. And I think being able to intuitively eat is very important because there's a lot of stigma out there for you know people like, oh my God, you know, wanting to be skinny or wanting to be this or wanting to be that. It's Everybody is gonna be what they are meant to be based on their own definition of health, right? For me, I'm really happy with where I'm at and Plenity helped me to develop a healthier food ritual. So yes, I lost 10 pounds within eight months using Plenity. That's great. 
Now, I don't really think that's a very cost effective way to lose weight because remember, Plenity is like $98 a month. So spending almost $800 to lose 10 pounds doesn't make sense. But there is something priceless that I got that's worth so much more than the $800 is the fact that using Plenity, I was able to de-ritualize food with a separate kind of like process that I needed to get in before I ate my food. So normally I would be just like whatever's in the fridge or snacking, doing whatever. But Plenity actually took the food ritual out of the box for me and turned it into something else. I had to realize that, hey, you know, two times a day when I eat my lunch and dinner, go grab my bottle of Plenity, get a big glass of water, you know, take your pills, drink 16 ounces of water and wait. And during this waiting period, I wouldn't just sit there and just like, no, what I would do is I would just, you know, move on with my life. I would clean the countertops. I would tidy up my bed. I would maybe sit down and do emails for a little bit longer, whatever it is I needed to do. And then I would realize that I was not as, I don't want to say I was not as hungry as I thought. It was more of like, I got a little bit closer in tune with what it is that I wanted to do when I opened that fridge. So when I went back in to go prepare my meal, I was able to make choices more in tune with what my body wanted. Like for example, I'm gonna have chickpeas and turkey, right? Took the plenity, sit down, had a little bit of time to like get out of that chaotic process of, oh my God, I'm gonna eat and get into a mind state of, hey, I'm gonna nourish my body. What is it that I want? And guess what? I was able to go in and eat what I wanted. What I wanted, I'm talking about what I wanted. If I felt for chocolate, I would have chocolate. If I wanted chickpeas and chicken and quinoa or whatever, I would have that too. But it was almost a state of mind. And of course, this didn't happen immediately. This happened after eight months of taking Plenity, right? It was the habit of slowing down. So Plenity taught me to slow down and enjoy the process, period. And I know it may be, you know, not what you're looking for with Plenity. Maybe you have a hundred pounds to lose and you're looking for something to help you get satiated faster and lose that hundred pounds. Plenity is good for that because ultimately if you're filling up 25% of the space in your stomach before you even sit down to eat, that's probably 25% less calories that you're gonna consume. You know, I think it could work for you too. I have friends and family that are taking Plenity now and they are losing weight. My sister was losing 10 pounds a month for the first three months she was on Plenity and she had a lot more weight to lose than me. So it does work if that's what you're looking to do. Now with me, I was already eating probably okay portions, but for me, it was the first time in my life. Guys, this is important. This is the first time in my life that I have been able to maintain a healthy weight for a year and a half. Let me say that again. This is the first time in my entire life that I have been able to maintain a healthy weight for over a year and a half. This is so important and valuable to me. This, this is the priceless piece because for the last, since I've been an adult, I have yo-yoed in my weight. I have gained and lost, like I said, the 40 to 50 pounds once a year or once every other year, I would be like, crash dieting, losing a bunch of weight, you know, like trying to like get skinny for vacation or whatever. And then I would binge eat because I had been restricting for so long that I would just lose control and, and just be so hungry and, and want to live my life. But now I am living my life every single day. I am eating what I want every single day. I'm listening to my body. If I'm not hungry for breakfast, I don't eat breakfast. If I'm feeling really hungry for lunch, I have a big lunch. And then later, this is my regular kind of way of eating now. And, and later for dinner, yeah, I want to munch something because I'm usually like, you know, curled up in a blanket watching TV or whatever. And I'm in that kind of comfortable space and, um, you know, kind of frame of mind where I do want something to make me feel comfortable. So I will get some tea and get some, you know, whatever, like some, some yogurt parfait with nuts in it or something like that. And it'll completely satisfy me versus before I was always like, I just always wanted to eat. I was like, what's next? What can I eat next? Oh my gosh, was this enough? Do I want dessert? Should I have dessert? No, I shouldn't have dessert. Like this crazy racing thoughts that were always in my head 
because I was always just like, oh my God, I want to lose weight. No, I'm hungry. I want to eat. Now it's like, listen, listen, I want banana bread. I want to have banana bread. Cool. I want another piece of banana bread. Guess what? I don't let it sit in my mind. I have my second piece of banana bread because plenity, right? I was like, hey, I took plenity. I'm safe. <laughs> so I would have my, if I still have space, I will have my second piece of banana bread. But you know what it did for me though? Is I realized after that second piece of banana bread, everything is fine. I didn't gain weight. My body is actually healthier and in the best shape I have been in my entire life and I'm eating what I want. And then because I started to trust my body because I need, I used plenity as a crutch a little bit, but it helped me to trust my body that, yeah, if you want a whole Snickers bar and that's what you really want, go for it, girl, go for it. And once I would eat the Snickers bar, I would be like, oh God, that was a lot. Like I'm super satisfied. Probably not gonna do that again for a while. Uh, Cause I just remembered how not that great Snickers was and move on with your life. So interestingly, I used Plenity to help me find my intuitive eating again. And I think at this point in you know time, I've used it for eight months. Yes, I did lose 10 pounds on it, but honestly, I couldn't care less. If I didn't lose 10 pounds, I would be fine. Since I did this, that's what I wanted to lose. Now I'm, you know, whatever my BMI, I'm not even gonna tell you guys, cause it doesn't matter, okay? I lost the 10 pounds, I'm really, really fit and toned. I'm exercising as often as I can. I'm eating generally pretty much whole foods. And if I want cake and ice cream, I have cake and ice cream. But at the end of the day, if you realize I'm eating 80% moderately whole, fresh, healthy foods, and the other 20%, whatever, cotton candy, bubble gum, you know, I don't know. Like honestly, Nutella for me. Nutella is is my kind of like kryptonite. But you know what? If I want Nutella, I go get a jar of Nutella and I eat Nutella straight out of the jar. And guess what? After two tablespoons, I'm just like, Bleh. I've had enough Nutella at this point. So that's kind of what I wanted to come here and tell you guys. Yes, I did plenity for eight months. Yes, I lost 10 pounds, which is exactly what I wanted to do. Yes, I learned how to maintain my weight, which was actually the most important goal. And yes, I would recommend it. Obviously, if you have more weight to lose, you will lose more weight with plenity because it will, you know, carve out 25% of your stomach space for it. But I just wanted to share with you, my goals were a little bit different, but plenity did help me achieve those goals. I do have an extra box of plenity up hanging around so if you have your prescription for plenity you might notice that if you're not using it fast enough you'll start getting boxes and these will just start piling up so you're going to need to go online to my.ro.co and cancel your prescription otherwise you will continue to get bills a hundred dollars a month and then you will continue to get boxes of plenity so i do have uh, plenity if i ever need it but i i honestly don't and so far plenity if you have an extra box just remember it's just fiber so you can keep taking a pill here and there just as a fiber supplement. I'm not a doctor, so don't take that as medical advice, but it is just something that I feel like it makes sense. So that's my story. Um, I would call it a success story. My bank account would maybe not call it a success story because that was $800 to lose 10 pounds. But honestly, $800, I mean, you can only lose one pound with lipo and pay more than $800. So maybe that is a success story. So I hope this was helpful for you for whatever reason you came to watch this video. I, I don't know if you wanted to hear something different, but remember everybody's got different goals with their bodies and their weights and whatever they wanna do with their life. So please be kind and please understand that when you are thinking about getting plenity, talk to your doctor or talk to the online doctor that's gonna be you know, discussing plenity with you and have all your questions answered there as well. I'm here to share my experience because that is what I do on this channel. And if you have any additional questions that are not answered, please feel free to leave a comment below. I respond to every single comment. I'm not like a big YouTuber or anything. So every night or every morning when I wake up, I do look at my comments and I will get back to you soon. So don't be scared to you know reach out to me because I'm here for you. That's what I do here on this channel for tools and tech for body and beauty. So until next time, guys, have a blessed day. And I hope that you achieve every single wish and dream that you put out there to manifest for yourself. So I'll see you on the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you soon.
バイ！